Hey everybody, it's Premier Gal here. <coughs> and Premier Pup. My friends over at Digital Anarchy in San Francisco have some pretty neat plugins you should be using in Premiere Pro. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Digital Anarchy Samurai Sharpen plugin using some footage I shot of Premiere Pup. Here you can see what the footage looked like before I applied the Samurai Sharpen plugin. In the after version, you can see the incredible detail that was brought out by the Samurai Sharpening tool. It really made him pop and created a more attractive image. Now before, he still looked cute. He's always handsome, but this sharpening effect really brought out more detail in his face, almost making the video appear as if it was shot in 4K. And this image was shot in 1080p on a Canon EOS M3. Samurai Sharpen works by locating all the edges in the picture. It then creates a halo on each side of the edge, making the light side lighter and the dark side darker. This increases the contrast of the image, making the image more sharp and pleasing to the eye. So to apply the effect, search for the Samurai Sharpen under effects. You can download the demo or purchase the plugin from digitalanarchy.com. Then drag the Samurai Sharpen effect on the video footage in your timeline. The first three Samurai Sharpen controls that you will see in the effects control panel are amount, radius, and edge mask strength. The amount controls the intensity of the sharpening. For standard sharpening, you want to keep it between 50 and 200. Anything higher than that will seem way over sharpened and anything lower won't really make an impact. So I'm going to set my image at 125. I think that looks great. The radius controls, however, control the width of the halo that is created on either side of the edge. If I increase the radius to five, you will see a dramatic effect. That's because there's more lightness on the light edge and more darkness on the dark edge. Now we don't want Premiere Prep to look like that, so I'm gonna keep the radius at two. Next, you will see the edge mass strength. This controls which edges in the image will be sharpened. The higher the number, the more dramatic the edge needs to be to be sharpened. If you check the box next to show sharpening, you will see that all the white in the image indicates what is being sharpened. If I turn the edge mask strength to zero, you will see much more of the image will be sharpened. But I think I would like a little bit more softness on the sides of Premiere Pup's face. So I'll bring it back up to five. Again, it's really all subjective and depending on what you're going for. If you wanna learn more about how to use highlights and shadow mask, check out Tor's tutorial on the Digital Anarchy YouTube channel. I will leave a link in the description box below. Remember, each video image will require its own customization. I'm happy with my newly beautiful and sharpened image of Premiere Pup. Thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. I'll see you all next time. Bye.